we are Living Antibiotics. Here to show you the difference between a friend and a foe. In previous parts, we have compared our Living Antibiotics with different kinds of honey. In this part, we will show the world how our lactic acid bacteria compare to the universal medicine antibiotics. Against one pathogen, antibiotics have proven to be an effective weapon. The only problem is that wounds and infections rarely contain one single pathogen, but many different kinds. And it's one of the reasons why antibiotic resistance has grown more and more and is turning on mankind. The results from our experiments have shown us what mankind has been fearful for the past decades. Against five pathogens, antibiotics simply cannot handle exposure and doesn't have the ability to counteract the pathogens. The lactic acid bacteria, as we have shown before, creates a transparent aura which means that the pathogens have been completely eliminated in the area of exposure. Our goal is to find a natural alternative to antibiotics, but not by finding something new, but by using something that has been lying in our hands for thousands of years. When Alexander Fleming discovered the first antibiotic in 1928, we didn't know what was expecting us in 100 years. Today, in 2015, we are facing one of the greatest crises in human history and that is the increase in antibiotic resistance. Our universal cure, antibiotics, have become our greatest problem, but right now we have got the power to solve it. We are convinced that the living antibiotics is the solution, but we need your funding to make this known, to make it big and to make things right. We need you to help us to help you and your children and all the generations to come. This was the final part of our four-part series. If you would like to support us, please visit our page on indiegogo.com.